today, we're diving deep into the history of our very own galaxy, the Milky Way. Galaxies are constantly evolving, and new discoveries are rewriting what we thought we knew about the Milky Way's past. Our galaxy isn't the only one that bumps and grinds with others. Mergers and collisions are a natural part of galactic evolution, and the Milky Way is no stranger to this messy process. We can see it happening all around the universe, with galaxies gobbling up their smaller neighbors. Even now, the Milky Way is slowly munching on its two small companions, the large and small Magellanic Clouds. Traditionally, scientists believe the Milky Way's last major merger happened way back in its early days, between 8 and 11 billion years ago. But new research is throwing a wrench into this theory. The European Space Agency's Gaia mission is a game-changer. Launched in 2013, it's meticulously charting the positions and motions of a billion stars in our galaxy. This incredible data is giving us unprecedented insights into the Milky Way's history. A recent study published in the monthly notices of the Royal Astronomical Society suggests a much more recent date for the Milky Way's last big crash, a mere 3 billion years ago. This research, led by Thomas Donlin, uses the wrinkles in our galaxy's stellar distribution as clues. These wrinkles aren't like wrinkles on your face, they're a scientific term for distortions caused by mergers. By measuring the movement of stars with Gaia's data, we can detect these wrinkles, like a fingerprint of the last major merger. Think of wrinkles as signs of aging. But for the Milky Way, it's the opposite. Donlin explains that the Milky Way seems to be getting smoother, like a cosmic Benjamin button. By analyzing how these wrinkles fade over time, we can pinpoint when the last major merger happened. There are other pieces of evidence besides wrinkles. Astronomers look for groups of stars with similar chemical fingerprints in unusual orbits. This could indicate a common origin, perhaps from a smaller galaxy that merged with the Milky Way. There are two main theories about the Milky Way's last major merger. One points to a collision with a dwarf galaxy named Gaia Sausage slash Enceladus, GSE, a long time ago. The other theory, the Virgo Radial Merger, VRM, suggests a more recent event, less than 3 billion years in the past. With each data release, Gaia provides a clearer picture. The latest data shows these wrinkles are far more prevalent than previously thought, supporting the VRM scenario. If the wrinkles were older, they'd be fainter and harder to see. The fact that they're so distinct suggests a more recent merger. Imagine countless wrinkles piled on top of each other, that's what an older merger would look like. This doesn't mean there's no evidence for the ancient GSE merger. Some stars might be from both mergers. Simulations play a crucial role in untangling this mystery. By comparing simulations with real data, researchers pinpoint the culprit, a dwarf galaxy collision around 2.7 billion years ago, which they've named the Virgo Radial Merger. As Gaia keeps delivering data, the picture of the Milky Way's past keeps evolving. The VRM likely involved multiple dwarf galaxies and star clusters. Future research will focus on differentiating stars from these different merger events, the Milky Way's history is being rewritten thanks to Gaia's incredible data. Our understanding of galactic mergers is rapidly changing, and the Milky Way's story is far more complex than we ever imagined. This is the Brain Maze, signing off.